My name's Oliver Heath, and my work focuses on how we can improve mental and physical health in our homes. Today I've come to meet a young family living in Seaford and to see how we can transform their front living room to create a space that's happy, healthy and helps them to connect with one another. One of the things that stress you out about this room? Just trying to work on the layout where we can enjoy the TV yeah. and if the movies are on in the evenings. I guess the layout means that it's kind of less sociable with a sofa going this way and one going that way. I often work there so it's just trying to find a way to filter out that noise a little. So maybe the room needs to kind of work both in the daytime, you know, with the yeah. kids and yeah. the mess and the, yeah. and the noise, yeah. but also at night it's just going to be really calm and relaxing. Yeah. I've got a few ideas. I'm going to head into Brighton and buy you a few bits and pieces that is going to transform this room and make it even better for you. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. Great. Yeah. See you later. Cheers. Thank Thanks. You. So I've left the guys in the house and they're cracking on with the wallpaper, the decorating, moving the furniture. And we're heading into Brighton to see if we can pick up some bits that are going to transform Sophie and Paul's living room. As a designer, I'm less interested in what our homes look like, but how they make us feel. So all of my work really looks at how we can improve health and well-being. It's about sunlight. It's about natural materials. It's how we bring plants and nature into our buildings as a means to aid recuperation and improve our stress reduction. Well, we had a great afternoon of shopping and we've squeezed a whole load of stuff into the back of the Renault. So we've got loads of plants, which is fantastic. I love loads of plants. We've got pots, we've got coasters, we've got a whole stack of stuff. So I can't wait to go and get it into Paul and Sophie's house. Our homes are probably the most important places in our lives, and yet they're taking on ever more functions. In a busy family life, there are so many different things going on. So getting the home right is absolutely fundamental to creating a happy and healthy place to live. Oh, hey, Sophie. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> I love it. You just get stuck yeah. with your space yeah. and you can't see the potential of it because it's such a lovely house. Oh, it really is lovely. I love how you centralise that painting. Yeah, we want to kind of like centralise things around your fire, because your fire is such a good yeah. social point. Yeah. And your office area just yeah. feels a little bit greener. And those plants are there just to kind of soak up the light and give you a bit of a focal point. Yeah. So it draws your eye through yeah. the space. Wonderful. Thanks. Yeah. Well, I'm going to leave you to enjoy your home. Brilliant. Oh, thank, thank you very so much. Hope you have a lovely time in it. Yeah. Lovely to meet you. You've left it a, a standard that I'll need to maintain. Bye -bye.